That black your magic. 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 Magic, magic, black your magic. That black your magic. That black yo. Look at that black yo. Hit me with all of that. Hey y'all, hey. Hope everyone is doing well and staying safe. First, let me apologize. I am having equipment issues and I'm so sorry that I was unable to upload for the last few weeks. I'm still having those issues, so I had to figure out an alternative just to be able to record, which is why you do not see this beautiful chocolate face. I miss you guys so much. I hope everyone is doing well. All right, y'all, so let's get into it. So today's episode is for those who like to eat something other than meat. So my vegans, my pescatarians, those who just want to have something that's not meat every now and again, this is for you. Today's episode, we are promoting Hooray Foods. Sari Awesome is the founder of Hooray Foods. He is lives in California, and one day they had a really bad fire. They were unable to leave their homes, and while being stuck at home, he just started to work his brain, putting together ideas, and voila, the bacon was created. So, Hooray Foods, they make plant-based meat, um, basically trying to design those to look and cook as well as taste like that real thing so it's dairy free gluten free as well as soy free this bacon here you guys which looks amazing (laughs) so excited can't wait to receive mine in the mail so that way i can be able to just tell you guys about it but this bacon that he's created from what the videos and reviews that I'm seeing, the it looks like bacon, it smells like bacon, and it even tastes like bacon. And part of the reason that it tastes like bacon, he was mentioning, is because of the smoke flavoring that he uses. So I thought that that was pretty cool. When you're cooking it, it gives you that, you know, sizzling and, you know, popping in the frying pan that real bacon actually gives you. And the good thing about it is you can literally take it out the packet and then just put it in the frying pan. You don't have to use any additional grease or oil, anything like that. It literally, from the coconut oil that is already in it, it just cooks and fries up for you. Definitely, when you guys get a chance, you definitely want to check out Hooray Foods. Currently, they are in some of the local stores in California, but you also have that option of ordering your bacon online so you can order it online with amazon you can also order it from imperfect foods uh gtfo it's vegan as well as veganessentials.com so you have those four different websites that you can actually order the bacon from if you're not locally in the cali area um when you guys get a chance definitely check out hooray foods now, if you have a Whole Foods market near you, double check with your supermarket because they may actually have this brand in stock for you. They're located in over 300 of the Whole Foods markets, so you never know. Your Whole Foods in your city, your hometown, they may actually have it, so you can definitely check it out to see if you're able to purchase it there. I know for us, for my husband and I, with us not eating any meat other than seafood, you know, trying to find that perfect crisp and flavoring and taste of a plant-based bacon or any type of meat that isn't, you know, going through that extreme process of, you know, being processed is something that's important to us. And Hooray Foods basically is saying that, you know, they're using a minimum processing when it comes to processing that bacon. So, you definitely want to check them out when you get a chance for Ray Foods. All of their information will be in the description box below. You'll be able to make you a nice little BLT, you know, a burger. If you want to make you a plant-based burger and then throw that bacon up on there, or if you're making breakfast, here is a good option. This is a colored-owned business. I believe Sari is from India 
or he is Indian because his name, if I'm not mistaken, definitely is an Indian name. Um, so we just want to make sure that we are supporting Black-owned businesses and colored businesses. So when you guys get a chance, definitely check out Hooray Foods. This bacon is going to cost you a little over $8. So around your typical price range for bacon, it is only 60 calories per slice. It has one gram of sugar. It has about 12% of sodium. And it is not really giving you much of any fat, just um, of 15% of saturated fat, so about four grams. So pretty, pretty good. Um, definitely healthier than your, your normal bacon. I know for my bacon lovers, it probably would be extremely hard to eat something like this, but definitely give it a try. Um, like I said, it looks like bacon when you're just looking at these pictures. It just it gives you that look of bacon. So definitely worth giving it a try. I know some people like turkey bacon, so it's also giving you kind of that turkey bacon look as well. As I mentioned, they're not located in a lot of the local stores. However, on their website, you can request a restaurant or store near your location. You just will put that request in online. The only downside of this is just not being able to order directly from their website. So, of course, when you're ordering from other websites, you're going to pay a few dollars more than what you would typically pay. But other than that, definitely is something to look into. Hooray Foods. Today's crowning segment goes to Miss Beatrice. B. Gaddy. She was a uh, council member and advocate for the poor here in Baltimore City. Um, she was known as like the the Mother Teresa of Baltimore, basically. Super dope. God rest her soul. She passed away October of 2001. And um, she was just amazing, you know, just like I said, advocating for the poor you know, uh, providing them, you know, meals several times throughout the year, especially during the um, holidays. That was just like a big thing for her, you know, making sure that they were able to eat. Just truly just like an honorable woman, just very loving, just an amazing woman, just an inspiring black queen. Um, just tip my hat off to her and to her family. Her daughters have been, you know, holding it down for the Begatti house and everything where they're still, you know, providing those meals and different things like that for the homeless and for the poor. So definitely just wanted to just honor her, just truly someone to look up to. Um, her Thanksgiving event was just something that just, was amazing just feeding everyone and just loving on everyone just truly someone you know inspiring that you can look up to so I'm so excited for just being able to partner with her and her daughters in the near future everyone who knows me they just know that giving back especially to those that are less than or have less than you know and giving back to the poor is just something that's near and dear to my heart so being able to feed them providing them clothing and you know different necessities and things like that may she rest in peace our queen miss begatti and we are sending love and flowers and hugs to her daughters and to her family from the crown me colored family all right that's our little tidbit for today again when you guys get a chance make sure you check out hooray foods all of their information will be in the description box below other than that it's been real y'all love y'all mean it carry on that melanin 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 hey, that melanin 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 that melanin 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 that melanin melanin, melanin. Yeah, yeah, yeah.